Hip hop aesthetics can still provide an invigorating source of black cultural resistance to Western imperialism by transcending the established realities of political subservience and economic exploitation through artistic mastery and cultural expression. Hip hop culture can even be considered revolutionary when it assists in ensuring that potentialities for human liberation remain alive and culturally accessible to the grassroots black community. However, conscious revolutionary lyrics are no substitute for actual human liberation. Even though such lyrics may be a part of the process in initiating a growth in grassroots consciousness, which is a necessary and fundamental precondition for any meaningful attempt at social change. The unchallenged permanence of Western imperialist social structures ultimately thwarts the stated emancipatory aims of black cultural resistance when such cultural resistance remains at a safe length from radical social praxis. As such, it is the spiritual responsibility of the hip hop intellectual to critically address and radically confront these structures of Western imperialism, which continue to thrive and remain socially relevant to the lived experience of the postmodern lumpen proletariat in neo-colonial American ghettos. The hip hop intellectual who embraces this spiritual responsibility inherently develops a more radical perspective of social critique. The current necessity of developing a critical consciousness for radical intellectual activity is becoming extremely urgent, especially as Western imperialism becomes more adept at camouflaging its true nature while continuing to suffocate possibilities for authentic human being and human liberation. Faced with the suffocation of these human potentialities, the hip hop intellectual is confronted with the responsibility of choosing a microphone, a laptop, or a semi-automatic handgun with spare clips. <laughs>